having been in school and everything else like that, I really didn't want to sit behind a desk all summer and wanted to expand my career opportunities and figured there's no cooler way to spend a summer than working at a ballpark. I thought I was just going to do mainly photography. I was like, I'll just shoot sports action. But I actually, it turned into so much more. I did graphic design, I did promotions, marketing. It was very different than what I expected, but it, it actually turned out to be much better. When I was uh, looking for in different places for internships, one of the things that um, really appealed to me about minor league baseball and volcanoes in particular was that I was going to be very hands-on uh, with everything uh, about the operations in there because minor league is such a small production. You walk into work thinking everything's going to be normal and we're going to do everything and then you get thrown curveballs. And that's what makes it interesting. That's the great thing about working baseball is you're not going to get your 9 to 5 mundane job. Yeah, they had its great times and its bad times. I mean, sometimes those curveballs weren't that great, but you grew from it and you worked through it. And that's part of the advantages of doing an internship is that you learn what you're really made of. You're going to have great days and you're going to have bad days. It's just making sure that the good days outweigh the bad and learning what you're really capable of doing. First day, I was really surprised at how much of of responsibility that they gave us as interns. Uh, I was already planning my, my first themed event when I first got there on my first day. It wasn't really, you know, cleaning peanuts up after the game. You're in college and you get marketing classes and all that stuff, but real world marketing that you were gonna use and you were gonna put into a presentation, into a client, into baseball, that was like a really big aspect of it. And we all were like, wow, we just learned so much and we were into it. With minor league baseball and having to work so many hours together, everything else like that. The camaraderie that you have with the people that you work with is huge. Whether or not they may be your favorite person in the world or anything else like that, you're still soldiers in the same trench and knowing that they went through the same eight game home stands like you did, you have a much different respect for people and a much different outlook on them. And everyone did their part and worked together. You have that on your resume and then you have great contacts with everyone that works in the volcano. So if you want to keep working in sports, you got tons of connections through all the people that you know through the volcanoes. I learned a lot about myself. I think that's a really important part about internships. Not only do you learn what you're going to do, what you want to do in your life in the future, but you learn more personally like what you're really good at, and that's, that's what helps you later in the real world. Jump in head first. It's an adventure. You know, there's going to be easy days and there's going to be hard days. You know, I'm not going to sit here and lie to you and say, oh yeah, it was the easiest thing I've ever done. Probably one of the most difficult things I've ever done, but also the most rewarding. The difference between the chase that walked in that door the first day and the one that left is two totally different people. You look at the ballpark the first day and you're in awe. You have a bunch of empty seats, and that first day in the first game, you're like, okay, how the heck am I going to do this and how the heck am I going to get through that? And after the first home stand, you start to get your momentum and everything else like that. But it forces you to grow as a person. You work hard, but you have fun. And then people notice you work hard. Other jobs notice you work hard. They know minor league baseball. It's, it's tough. And if you can you know, get through a minor league baseball season, you can work for a minor league baseball team and be productive in that. People know you're valuable. You can be a valuable asset to them. My major selling point is, would you rather work in a cubicle or at a ballpark? For me, there's no better view than looking out at a baseball field. 